Hello and welcome. In this video, we are going to talk about how to interpret information from a stem and leaf diagram. We have here a stem and leaf diagram from which we are supposed to find the mode, the median, and the mean. Let's add the range down here. Below this diagram is a key that we should use as a guide to read the values from the diagram. So this number is 11. That means these are tens and this side are units. This number must be 16. This is 29, 35, 50 and 56. So first we want to find the mode. The mode is the most frequent number. That is the number that repeats more often. A closer look at the stem and leaf diagram that we have. We can see that the number 35 is appearing three times. So 35 is the mode. Note here that 24 is also repeating, but once we only have two 24s, but there are three 35s. So 35 is the mode. Next, we want to find the median. The median is the number that splits the data into two groups, the upper half and the lower half. Let's look at our diagram. We want to split the numbers by cancelling out. Let's do it here. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We remain with this number in the middle, which is our median. So the median is 31. Note here that we only count the numbers that are on the leaf side of the diagram. We have nine digits before 31, which is our median, and nine digits after the median. The median is 31. Let's move on to find the mean. To find the mean, we add all numbers and divide the total by how many numbers added. We have 19 numbers in the stem and leaf diagram. So the mean for this data is 11 plus 14 plus 16 plus 23 plus 24 plus 24 plus 27, 29, 30, 31, 35, 35, 35 plus 38 plus 41 plus 42 plus 47 plus 50 plus 56. The total is 608. Now we're going to share this equally. In other words, let's divide the total by 19. So we have 608 divided by 19, which is 32. So the mean is 32. Lastly, we are going to find the range. The range is so simple to find. It is the difference between the biggest and the smallest values that we have. So the biggest value in our data set is 56 minus the smallest value is 11. That means the range is 45. Thanks for watching. 